hello welcome to the channel so in today's question we have a quadrant with radius 6 cm inside it we are drawing a semicircle and we are drawing a tangent from this point to the semicircle if the length of the tangent is x then the question is find the value of x so here in this diagram we have to find the length of tangent or we have to find length of BD so solve our question will extend BD and OA and let's assume they are meeting at point E let's join PC PC is a radius so it's perpendicular to the tangent now here OA is also the radius of the quadrant so OA is 6 cm thus OP is 3 PA is 3 and PC that's also radius is 3 cm Let's assume here the CD length is A, DE is B and AE is C centimeter. Now if you look at BO and BC, so these are the tangent on the semicircle from an external point B. So they will be equal in length. So BO is 6 and thus BC will be 6 centimeter. Let's take this angle E here. Now if you look at the triangle, the big triangle BOE and the small triangle that is triangle PCE. In these two triangles both are right angle triangle and angle E is common in both the triangles. So both the triangles are similar and thus ratio of sides will be equal. So here I am taking BO upon PC. So that's BO upon PC is equals to OE upon CE. Now the BO length, BO is nothing but 6 cm, PC, so PC is 3 cm, OE, so OE is 3 plus 3 plus C and CE is A plus B. So putting these values in the equation, we'll get 6 upon 3 is 6 plus C upon A plus B. So here simplifying it, we'll get value of A plus B as 3 plus c by 2 now here we'll take another ratio for both the triangles we are taking ratio of bo upon pc equals to be that is the hypotenuse upon pe hypotenuse of another triangle so bo upon ce that's 6 upon 3 and be be is 6 plus a plus b and pe is 3 plus c now here to solve it further We'll put this value of a plus b in this equation. So this equation will be simplified in form of c only and then we'll solve it to get value of c as 2 cm. Now this value of c we can put in this equation to get a plus b as 4 cm. To solve it further we need value of a and b and for that we need one more equation. To form that equation, we'll use intersecting secant theorem. So that is if two secants for a circle are intersecting at a external point. For that, we'll take circle as our blue circle and that external point as point E. So here one secant will be EB which is there. And the second secant for that we'll assume that this point, this line segment that is EA that's meeting at the blue circle at point M. So as per intersecting secant theorem, ED times EB, right? D and B are the intersecting points of the secant. So ED times EB, that will be equal to EA times EM. That's the point at which it will meet the blue circle. Now here let's put the value. ED is B centimeter. And EB, EB will be 6 plus A plus B. Now this will be equal to EA. EA is C centimeter which is nothing but 2. We have already calculated that as 2. So EA will be 2. EM, EM will be 2 plus the diameter of the blue circle which is 12. So EM will be 2 plus 12 or 14 centimeter. So this will be equals to 2 times of 14. 
now here in this equation we can put a plus b as 4 and solve it to get b as 28 divided by 10 or b is 2.8 centimeter now a plus b is 4 centimeter thus a will be 1.2 centimeter and we know value of a and we know value of bc and thus the value of x or the length of tangent is nothing but 7.2 centimeter i hope you enjoyed the solution i'll see you in next video till then tata bye bye